Jesus loves you, my dear people of Dubai, UAE. Jesus loves you. Our Heavenly Father loves you. And I am so grateful to our Lord Jesus. He is the head of our church. And today, this week, from November 5 to November 12, is our 30 years, 30 years anniversary, 30th year. And you would have seen a small clipping. Revival, revival was brought into Middle East from our Lord Jesus, from the Holy Spirit through King's Revival Church International UAE, of which you are all a part, all of us. Many have passed through this ministry, thousands, thousands into various countries, some are in other churches. The Lord blessed them all. But we can just rejoicingly say, revival in Middle East came into through this ministry with the great love of Jesus, the love of the Father, Son and the Holy Spirit and the mighty power with signs, wonders, miracles, life in abundance. He loves you, loves you, loves you. Even today, I thank God for my dear sons who put this all together. It is not easy. They have done a tremendous sacrificial effort for the Lord Jesus and his church and his kingdom in times like this and we are in the process of getting full approvals it will all come but today's service I thank God for the blessed praise and worship I thank God for every one of you who have come forward to put this together the other language services are being carried out as usual in the various languages. This is the main English service. So there may be dear ones gone here and there to other churches. Bring them all into this place of great love and great power of the Holy Spirit with life in abundance. You are sure of Jesus in this church, in this church. So if you have your dear ones who have gone here and there, Bring them all. We are still increasing. We are still overflowing in UAE as well as in UK. We are going to be and worldwide as the voice with the word of Jesus. And just this 10 minutes, my loving children. And after that, you will have the Lord's table. You will have the tithes and the offerings as a, as a proper church service. And you will be blessed. Jesus said, believe the gospel, believe. We have been called to believe in Christ Jesus. We have been chosen to believe in Christ Jesus. No matter who you are, he loves you, loves you, loves you. Believe in him. That's all. God would never tell us to do something for which he doesn't give us the grace or the power. He gives us his grace. He gives us his love. He gives us his mighty power for me and you to believe in times like this. You dear ones, all of us, we tend to believe what the world says, probably the news media, probably some people. But Holy Spirit is telling me and telling you to believe the words of Jesus. It is, it, it is a struggle in these times. But believe, overcome every unbelief. Believe he loves you. Believe he lives for you. Believe he defeated Satan and death and hell and curse for your sake. Believe he is coming to rapture us in midair. Believe he is making mansions for us in heaven. Believe he protects you on this earth. Believe he will provide for you on this earth everything needed. Believe he is your healer. Believe he is your deliverer. Believe he is our life and life in abundance. 
long life, well satisfied with salvation until rapture and eternal. Believe he gives us victory in whatever we do. Believe he loves you, loves you, loves you. Believe he has forgiven us and cleansed us with his blood even now. Believe no weapon against us will ever prosper. Believe we will live and live until rapture and eternal with our child and family, or your children and family, or in whatever way you are. Believe, believe, believe your heavenly Father loves you. And I can go on like this. Believe he gives us the power never to sin again never to sin again. Believe he never condemns us, never judges us. He loves us, saves us, redeems us, gives us life even now. With such a protection on this earth until rapture and eternal. Believe he will prosper you. Believe he will open doors for you. Believe he will take care of you. He is Jesus, the son of the living God. He loves you, loves you, loves you. And then, my dear children, as we are entering into the 30th year of our anniversary, this week is our 30 years anniversary. Oh, Jesus is the foundation. Jesus is the head. And Jesus builds the church. How he has made this ministry so big, overflowing, large in UAE, Middle East, and now worldwide. He loves you, then belong to him. Believe in him, belong to him, belong to him. We don't belong to the world. We don't belong to this defeated evil of this world. We belong to Jesus. He paid the price, died and rose from the dead, shedding his holy, holy blood for sinners like us. You belong to the Lord Jesus, I belong to Jesus. Our names are written in the Lamb's book of life in heaven. Our citizenship is in heaven. We belong to the Father in Jesus Christ. We belong to him. You don't belong to money. You don't belong to silver and gold. You don't belong to anything false and anything that is glamorous and glittering. Please, my loving dear children, you and I belong to the cross. We belong to the cross on which Jesus died to save us. He rose, he rose, he lives. And you and I shall live also with our homes, our families, our generation until rapture and eternal. We belong to the truth. We belong to the holiness of God. We belong to Jesus. Oh, we are the flesh and body of Jesus. No matter who you are, he loves you, loves you, loves you. You and I and all, we belong to Jesus. Yes, you don't belong to this world. You don't belong to the defeated evil pleasures of this world. We belong to Jesus. Romans 8 verse 9. Ah, so we believe in him. We belong to him. We belong to heaven in Christ Jesus. Then, my loving, my dear children, we must become like him. So we believe in him, we belong to him, and we must become like him as his bride. We must become his bride. We must become his bride. Oh, beloved, we believe in him, we belong to him, and we become his bride. Three, three important, powerful, prophetic, powerful promise word. Prophetic, powerful promise word. We believe in him. We belong to him. We become his bride in the coming years until rapture and eternal. In this 30th year, it's very important for all of us. We have greater works, more works, better works to do until rapture. We must be his bride. Bride is to resemble Jesus, to be like Jesus. Bride and the bridegroom become one. We and Jesus become one through his blood, through his Holy Spirit, through his word.
He loves you, loves you, loves you. He, you and I must become his bride more and more, more and more in the coming years until rapture and eternal, resembling Jesus, truly representing Jesus, becoming like him in love, in holiness, in humility, every fruit of the Spirit, the mighty power, the mighty power of his resurrection. He loves you. Don't let us not become like anyone else. Let us not become like anyone on this earth. Let us become like Jesus, his pride in every way, gentle, humble, pure, with the mighty power of the Holy Spirit, huh? patient, long-suffering, forgiving, being kind to others, huh? yeah. all the fruit of the Spirit. We must be that. Holy Spirit is there to give us the power. The word of God is there to give us the power. The blood of Jesus is there to give us the power to become, to become like Jesus, his bride. So we believe in him, we belong to him, and we become his bride. That is what the vision of this ministry is. Everyone, whoever steps into this ministry, at least once, must become his bride, the true bride of Jesus. So humble, holy, honest, in truth, in truth, in truth, honest, my loving children. Oh, our innermost being must be like Jesus. Our innermost spirit and soul must be like Jesus, the bride of Jesus. So my great children, Tell everyone we must believe, belong to, and become his bride. All of us. Every Friday we will be having this service and I will be ministering to you. And my great senior pastors are there who will now take on and minister and do the Lord's table and then the tithes and the offerings and the benediction my great sons will do. I once again thank all of you. Remember, believe in Christ Jesus, belong to Christ Jesus and become the bride of Jesus Christ until rapture and eternal. Jesus loves you, loves you, loves you. See you again, see you again, see you again. Amen.